So so I'm coming back to today. Got a really, really, really probably good be short jumping off video on YouTube. Really quick. Again, I'm probably not gonna try to speak too long on this. Jumping right into it though, of course. Uh, we do get all the new stuff for Decker now, of course. I know I'm a little bit late on this, so of course, if you try to upload these videos in order, I have been going scattering back and forth between the last couple of days. I'll plug these videos out in order again now. I did do a day download video, I just put that one I have almost ready. Um gotta do that one. Then of course you gotta do um 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 the Hate Number One App Store. Today we actually did Hate Number One in the App Store for um of course, I'll get a top grossing right up for, um, um, Duncan Battle, for, um, the Blue and, um, Blue Tanks and, um, um, Goku Vegeta Battle. I don't know, my mind just went scattered there, because when, when I'm doing these intro videos, it's like, oh, crap, I might forget something. But yeah, of course, it's, again, this is for both Global and JP, nothing different, all getting the same units and, stuff, units and stuff like that. Again, it's gonna be structured well and stuff like that, of course, again. Gold Boy JP doing this at the same time. I'm just telling you guys that. But yeah, again, it's pretty much the same stuff we kind of got from last time. So yeah, again, gonna head, head heading right to the video though. Of course, again, everything for Doki now for both Gold Boy and JP. There's some stuff that they did show. I think one thing they didn't show on Gold Boy and JP, of course. Um, they were actually waiting for the Goku and Hercule from the new story event. I'm gonna go back in a quick second. Um, only the only global side they revealed that I just I watched the last team fully from both Goldway and JP. They didn't reveal the awakening for Hercule and Goku. Weirdly, maybe they just forgot on top of the head. The other JP was actual live stream, global was just a video, stuff like that. They did have a kind of Goku, and it was way obvious. They just premiered it, stuff like that. It was like way obvious, like, but I'm sorry, but yeah, um. But yeah, again, don't mind getting right to the video, of course, we are getting, um, I think we got 60 kills for the live stream already. Um, we hit, like, what, 3,000 retweets and stuff like that, and we already have that gift box, so go ahead and get them and stuff like that. I was, at the time I was recording, it isn't a gift box, I did check it out. I think I had, like, what, 1,500, like, 2 stones, now, like, I went 1,013, I think, 14 stones? But yeah, again, I've been kind of, you know, collecting stuff and stuff like that a lot lately. Because I just, uh, for Global specifically, I know it's going to be, like, Ultimate Gone, and, like, Proving Go Tanks, and Kyle's going to go from and Vegeta. But I kind of know the kind of talent timeline is going to be kind of set up and stuff like that, of course, basically. So, um, of course, again, the thing being Mario Bros. Are... <laughs> I mean, yeah, these guys aren't in the game yet, by the way. They're not in the game. Also, I do have the banners up for them as well. I'm going to go over in a second. And the banners are really, they're insane, though. They're good. At the same time, they are kind of bad, in a way. I want to say they are good and they are bad at the same time, but they are both really good, though, honestly. So, yeah. Um, again, being watched for our team is really obvious and stuff like that. Uh, we got uh, the whole team and stuff like that. Of course, it's a new escape from, um, the inhabitants, um, of Boo and stuff like that. Basically, you know, Goba and JP collab thing. Basically, of course, Goba and JP had to work together so we can get, um, you know, get everybody out of Boo, basically, and stuff like that. Of course, we get rewards and stuff like that. Of course, we're already gonna get a new wallpaper. I know people already, like, getting my dick and stuff like that, but in the game already. Um, I see, though, again, this is gonna be a new wallpaper for my background for my phone, so. Again, I love this house, it's so good. Like, they, again, we already knew it was gonna be that. I know, for, I think for part two, I uh, maybe for part two, we probably can get another wallpaper because we just see animated I think, wallpaper for it. Um, because like I had like Maj Bor again, I didn't need a video from them already, you could do all around here and stuff like that. I have to kind of combine other stuff from other videos and my other main videos, but yeah. Um, but yeah though, really though, um that's how to be structured and stuff like that. Of course, you know, if y'all is done, you get a free wallpaper, typical stuff you already know, but again, if you just see my other videos, um again, it's kinda of like I'm doing a second campaign for um a celebration. I did do a main video, again, looking at this one right here or an iPhone book. book. You might like all my videos and stuff like that. So you got to see all the content. You know, like Sonic, you like Ben 10, you like Pokemon, you like Beyblade, all this stuff. Yeah. Again, I try to have variety for my channel and stuff like that, of course. Yeah. Um, yeah, escape from um the having the boo, of course, the multiply campaign. For both Goba and JP, again, you get some wallpaper and stuff like that. Really simple rules and stuff like that. Again, Goba and JP are working together and stuff like that. You get this done. New launch event, treasure hunt event. Again, at the time of recording, they should be live already in the game. Basically, you can get seven stones a day, adds up, I think, to like 20, I think. Um, they put overall, I think you can do it for like a week, and they'll add up to 100 stones. So, again, I think it's like 20 stones a day, I think. You can um, add up to 100 stones. Again, this was a um, thing that was kind of teased already, like, pretty much before the down celebration. When we began, it was like, okay, we're gonna get like 100 free stones. I thought that was gonna be the gold for JP units, which really we did not get this time around. I thought they're probably gonna save it for part two, maybe, because we're already doing a lot of stuff in part one. Maybe they figured, okay, we're gonna do some stuff in part two. And then we're gonna get like a special group outfit as well. A lot of people thinking we could get new units. If they did, they probably would data behind it right now, but because I know some important girl did that boo. And there's a special boo on the battlefield, which I will go over again. And we're we'll, we'll gonna go over this event as well, because it come out at the same time. I'm gonna go over them myself. And if it just comes out, I did a lot of shit from launch creators this year again. Like, it's just and stuff like that. Again, if it, like, it's this is just because by the time I came back, again, you get 20 cents a day. Yeah, like I said that. Um, in the span of the whole week, you will get up to 100 cents. Again, it says right there, basically attempt the event for a whole week, get 100 free stones. Again, this is already a V-Jump for Goku and Hercule. For Goku and Hercule, um, L Hercule and Hercule, 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 you know, our kid boom and stuff like that. We're gonna probably get our part two wallpaper and stuff like that again. Pretty much, are we kind of what we're gonna get for part two and stuff like that? I 
we'll make a video for that, but I would see with part two and stuff like that, but it's kind of obvious maybe what we're going to see, but yeah. Of course, the launch event again, you do it for like a week, um, you get 20 stones, um, um, you get 20 stones, you could say you get 20 stones, um, you do the event every week, and of course, you get as up to 100, so yeah. That was, um, that was going on, of course, early weeks and stuff like that for the down celebration. Of course, you got a new, um, meat item, basically, every day, each meat is a large meat, you can get it every single day, and stuff like that. Not really, though, but you can't get a new meat every day, you have to do a stage again for like, um, they probably encourage you to do a stage like every day and stuff like that. Kind of weird though, but again, they encourage you to do it every day. So again, make sure not to skip this event and stuff like that. Um, again, if you skip this stuff like that, it's kind of like you're gonna miss out on the item and stuff like that. So kind of just be careful. But yeah, again, it's always the item and stuff like that. I think this is already kind of damn on beforehand, but again, I'm gonna you know go over it and stuff like that. Of course, but yeah, again, do this every single day and stuff like that. Make sure to do it and stuff like that. Of course. Um. You're right here, yeah, the new story event, basically the final blue arc, you know, end of the blue arc slash power shutdown thing. I know we got a new hooker asset right there, we'll probably see that as like, maybe like a card art, maybe, you know, access to part two. <laughs> I'm joking though. Um, I don't know. It could be that. But I do, I do, I do, I do like the background of the hooker of course, though. But that's what I see how Legends kind of, but, um, maybe these assets from, assets from Legends are different, so I would like the background of the hooker. It was really good though, but yeah, of course, you can go from that event you just make in. Right here, yeah. Of course, um, this book right here, Darkwing Duck, because it's a three. Um, and he does, I think he transforms back to base. Um, anyway, he's like 59% or above. I think for um, Urgo Blue, um, he'll go, I think he hits like about 59% on health or something like that. Um, um, I think we hits like his health. I think it's the same thing with Goku when he hits like 59% or 58% health. Um, he'll go back to the regular Hercule again. So it's, it's like a swapping like unit and stuff like that. So yeah, it's Hercule. Um, so yeah, he's definitely took you the SSR version and stuff like that. Um, but again, Hercule's is pretty amazing to do a battle road and stuff like that. I mean, that comes out, she's doing a battle road, comes out from Global. I guess we're going to JP and stuff like that. I guess we're going to be, again, they're going to be a solid play units and stuff like that. It's obvious they were going to awaken though, but yeah, of course, I think they're kind of like swapping for like three units for Goku. Again, just turn phone back, I think. Um, the base when, um, um, again, like when it hit health is like, I think 59% of her heart feel and stuff like that. Um, I think it's a little bit different as well. I don't know how it's going to be structured though, of course, not for this but of course though. Um, yeah, that's how we structure it and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, again, that was a cool story event. Again, it'll be a couple more days. We'll probably see it maybe for part two. Maybe we're going to probably update it, but it happens so. Here, here, I definitely know, yeah, the um, do Doka Fest units, I can know that already. Um, yeah, we heard, of course, you know, Vegeta, uh, Vegeta goes to the Super Vegeta, and of course, Buhan, uh, Blue Tanks, he goes to the Buhan. Again, that will bring up some of the Blue Saga stuff. Again, I think in December, everybody's kind of speculating, we get to, like, a Super Saiyan Goku, so we get Blue. They'll go have an active skill, call the Vegeta, like, hey, you're number one, and, you know, probably keep Blue on or certain the Earth or something like that, you know, being like a tank and stuff like that, or, you know, for Goku Vegeta, if you're like a swap unit, like in December, that officially end up the Blue Arc, and that kind of just makes sense, though, because, you know, um, we had, you know, we have Boone, but thanks for Golden Week, then, you know, um, you know, like, for special with uh, for some and stuff like that, like, at the end. Uh, uh, for Global, I think, I don't know, Mahi Vegeta, and, um, Susan 3, um, Age of Growth, I know, Tech Mahi Vegeta. They came out in May for Global, that's always been the time soft for that. I think, I know, that, I think that's when Super Strong came out, for Global and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, I think that was going to be structured. I feel like that could be the same thing as well, I have a Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and a Kid Boo for, um, the ending for the December. Careful the next one. Careful the Um, I have right here. Yeah, of course, the Goku and Vegeta units, they show them off on Twitter and stuff like that. Um, again, I'm gonna all in a separate video, my full reactions and stuff like that, simple stuff. Again, I said I wasn't gonna make the video that long, of course, JP did it as well. Again, super simple stuff in here, and of course, I use my mouse to push, um, fully and stuff like that, because I like it and stuff like that. Of course, so yeah, a new TN and stuff like that, a new TN and Blue Echo, which I did show up on the live stream. I guess I didn't want to go for one out, because I didn't, like, these guys were kind of in the dark, though, but yeah. I was never with the same unit though, um, Blue's good for power, absorption, and you know, they're basically like the, um, Kid Blue in the war, and the Kid Blue, they got, um, STR, um, Great Sam and Super Saiyan 2, and I'm gonna say, um, Blue's good to war, or basically just support type units for their specific categories. For TN, I know it's Magic Blue Arc, I think attack plus 30%, and, um, HP, um, um, I think HP and attack, um, I think attack is like 30%, and like HP is like 50% or something like that. The attack is, um, I think like 20%, and I think um, defense is like 30, I think, or for like much broader category allies and stuff like that. And Boo Piccolo is basically, um, or Boo or Piccolo. It's basically, I'm glad that we didn't need a new version of him. Like, the version we had, like, we had no good version of this guy. So, really glad he is. Again, the much broader links and stuff like that categories are all gonna be really good. Again, linked in my other video, of course, that's what I said before. Um, specifically for this, again, they're both. Worrying about the same unit at the end of the day. Then they go through like Boo and Super Vegeta right here. They're basically the same unit. Essentially, like, this is Vegeta right here. Basically, it's just, um, hit Vegeta, 
and use the same thing for me. Yeah, of course, I didn't want to go over this as well. The um, events have been updated and stuff like that um, for both Global and JP. Of course, again, this is for both Global and JP. The events have been sort of updated and stuff like that. So, you can go ahead and do the story event and stuff like that. Of course, sorry, man. Um, the events event has been updated. I do like going over this kind of so you guys can get fair medals and stuff like that. So, it's supposed to be easy to kind of go through that type of thing with this. But, um, ooh. Good. Good. Um, alright, I'm back. Um, I had to do something really quick, of course. But yeah, like I said though, um, it's a bit of updated and stuff like that, so you can get metal for them. Of course, the end of um, Joker Mekin, with these new, um, metal stuff like that, of course, from the, um, the Vegeta event. Kind of ran out of breath doing something, um, real quick. So yeah, of course, you guys will do like quick edits and stuff like that. I know a lot of people can be mad at Boo because, you know, oh yeah, Goldberg doesn't have the Boo event. Well, I get, like this, um, I think this Boo event right here. That boo specifically. Um, I know he's not on Global right now, but of course, you know, it doesn't really matter because he's still Duck Wiggins, but um, he's still Duck Wiggins to LR. Maybe if you do the update that, maybe, but for Global's already implemented because he does take um, all the old blue medals um, and stuff like that. But yeah, um, like, yeah, all these old like, blue medals down here and stuff like that. Typical, 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 typical. But yeah, again, those um, updated events like the Buhan and stuff like that, of course. I think, yeah, for two turns and stuff like that. Yeah, they um, changed that, though. Yeah. So, yeah, this is the old blue event, though. Um, so I want help off. Yeah, he does. Yeah, down here is like on um, the 26th, yeah, Super 2. Um, but yeah, again, a lot of characters wake I think it's probably one of the most dope best um, units to um, actually awaken from the colors of it and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, like I said though, of course, um, again, a lot of stuff like this happens though, of course, but yeah. Um, again, the Dokken events are really easy to go through and stuff like that. That's why I don't really spend too much time on this because it's super simple and easy to kind of go through all these, um, pretty much. But yeah, like I said before though, of course, um, just some updates for the events and stuff like that. Again, I mean, back in the day, Bootleg Global was the toughest, probably one of the toughest Dokken events events, but nowadays, you can easily, easily, easily. Yeah. Um, move the back to back up here. Yeah. Again, Dokken events have been updated and stuff like that. Of course, time to get to the boys' banner. So, yeah. I'm not saying it's easy. Pull that face, Iggy. Yeah. Um, and, uh, and. Come on, Hey, dog, what's up? Yeah, like I said, though, I'm back, though, of course, on BM. Um, of course, the Dokken Fest events have been updated, of course, um, I mean, the way it does, the, um, Dokken Fest Live, and stuff like that, this Gobbles banner, really good banner, the banners are insane. But the time, also like, oh, god. But yeah, overall, the are both really good, honestly. They did a really good job for this, um, I have a clicking on my head. So, of course, this is the Global banner right here. Again, Bar Beyond the banner is super cool for Global, of course. We got lots of LRs out here, like, one, two, three, four. Yeah, four LRs on it. That's insane. But yeah, Resumes are pretty good. Of course, AGO Super Vegeta is amazing. Has his EZA. Really good EZA unit. The physical Vegeta has aged a little bit, but it's super cool. He's the young banner. Shift from Goku. Oh, God. I mean, oh, Vegeta's on the other banner. Oh, God. Um, let's see what Angel Goku's amazing. It's great because for Global, they just came out like two months, a couple of months ago. Was it June? Yeah, July, June. Yeah, I think like two, three months ago they've been out for global, so yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, it kind of makes sense that it'll come back, but um, that also means they might come back on the Gotenks banner, because I think that's going to be in November for global, but again, it's going to be like, like a month difference and stuff like that, because they're doing the Fest banner, it's usually like a whole month, so, um, maybe I'm like, all the way, maybe up to celebration, though, of course, but yeah. I get brought up on the banner, is good, that means, you know, <laughs> we got his counterpart on the other banner, <laughs> but yeah, um, his evil counterpart, yeah. Of course, and Vegito, like, of course, and Vegito in the... So, uh, 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 they were just on the, they were just on the anniversary banner, so... Again, I had a feeling Vegito might have been on here, but you already know that Vegito's on the banner. Um, again, in the context, um, and stuff like that, of course, you know, typical stuff. Uh, yeah. Um, in the context of stuff like that, of course, you know, it's gonna be weird, and stuff like that, of course, yeah. But who's got a new TN and stuff like that, of course, you know, Vegito, and so they go to Vegito. Pretty good stuff. Um, I think the JP banner as well, again, they always change up the banner. They could just go take on here, that's pretty much it. I know a lot of people are going to be super mad though for um, JP and stuff like that. I know a lot of people are going to be super mad because um, JP Banner, again, go take and stuff like that. Because Cooler is finally back on Global for the first time. So yeah, it's good. Again, if you want to give him coins, go ahead. I recommend that or Dragon Pets LRs. But again, the Cooler is too good to pass up. Um, so we said 4 Vegeta is good. Again, Booth Banner would probably say they're both evenly good. They're both insane though. Let me go back to Global. Um, again, both the Barons are both nuts. Um, again, both the Barons are pretty much neck and neck though. Um, 
I'm going with Jamie. Didn't change that proof for that. Um, proof of protection and stuff like that. But yeah. I'm um, just going with Baron, though. Of course, like I said, um, who won't be on here? Super cool. He's still pretty good at this in VA. Super Bill, uh, Trevor Vegeta, and Goku. Again, they've got so many banners. I'm tired of them. Um, specifically for me. I already have them and stuff like that. And you know, Goku and Eddie Vegeta, of course, really good. Again, they just came out and stuff like that. But essentially, probably kind of balanced banner. Dark theme and stuff like that. Really good. Cool, amazing for Global. Again, for Global, specifically, Cool is not on JP. Um, you can keep that the place, but Of course, like I said, well, Cool is really good on the banner. Um, of course, Bohan's still good. Bohan is really good. Um, you know, specifically for Evil Mighty Brock at, at enemies. Um, so it's, it's pretty good. Uh, Gogeta being on the banner, pretty good, of course. Susan for Vegeta. I mean, it's, I mean, it's just kind of weird, though. Gohan out here is like, oh my gosh, so just remind me of the pain already. Man, I feel like Gohan will be on the banner. Um, I wonder if that MVG was going to be on the banner as well. So we're saying fours, I don't know, they just came back for a little It's kind of weird. Like, back to back. But at the same time, you know, last year we had a trip for the And go back to back. Yeah. Again, JP Baron's the exact same thing as well. Just think of it. And a lot of people are like, oh yeah, JP Chef, JP Chef, JP Chef. But, um, Again, this was kind of typical though. This always happens. Last year they changed up the banner, of course, the Goldberg banner. Again, the banners are really insane. At the same time, it's like, I mean, again, they look bad and they're good at the same time. But for Goldberg for this banner, I know I'm not gonna pull anything. Again, I never pull it down on celebration units ever. And I have almost every video in the game. I never gonna pull these guys. But yeah, so banners and stuff like that, really, really, really good. Again, I can spend all day on this. Um, I think guys, like, I can make a whole video on this. Oh wait, man. But yeah, again, for um, Goldberg and stuff like that. Again, simple stuff like that. Super, super simple stuff. But yeah, good guy in the video here. There's all the stuff for the new Duncan now. Again, gold has been really good. Again, I probably recommend trying to get cool points with yes, Or We're in the Dark Fest LR, because again, Blue and Go take Blue and like Super Vegeta probably I'll probably give me back. Um <clears throat> excuse me. Probably gonna be back, you know, maybe a couple months from now. I go on and sell the next back for all the good minutes. But maybe ten months or something like that, maybe. Um again, bears are insane though. They really are insane for both playing champions. The bears are really both insane. But yeah, like I said though, of course, um again, um bears are really jam packed with really good units. Again, Bardock and Oh my god, Bardock, um, and Cool Band on the Opal Banner is really good, so I guess they're gonna be kind of airs now. Kind of makes sense because they came out at the same time, not the same time, so but yeah, kind of the same thing. But Bardock and Cool for Global made really good sense. Boo and Go Tanks being on JP makes sense, you know, Boo things like that. I thought Pickle was gonna be on here, but he's never first. He's like a first, but yeah. It was on Go Tanks and Banner, but yeah. Gonna go ahead and end it here, though, but yeah. Pretty good stuff for both Boo and JP. Again, the rares are really insane. I recommend Boo for his guys are really good. Again, the first couple units are like, eh, but when it gets up to Angel Goku, to, um, Super Vegeta and stuff like that is really good, and for Blue Piccolo, um, pretty good banner though, again, both banners are really insane, they're both insane, I can't recommend either or, they're both good, this one probably recommend more for Super players, because Cooler, again, do not miss it on Cooler, he's really good though. but of course, it's all new stuff for Duncan now, of course, all new Awakenings, new stuff, banners, stuff like that, again, gonna, hit, gonna go ahead and end here, because I got those videos I'm gonna do, I want those banners as well though, again, full bunch of of course, yeah, so for myself, yeah, see you guys later though, um, I guess what I'm See you guys later though. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Oh, quick okay. again though. Um, so we got to think about the new Duckin' Out info. We got to think about the banners are great, amazing. We'll go over them in separate videos though. Of course, we'll see you guys later though. Again though. Peace out.